fixing a got an auto tune going on on this thing. See, uh, see what I can do with it. see this uh, it's uh, calculating a map on here it's the fuel pack 3 and it's uh, it's all it's auto tune see if you can see it there's the Sun
of gas, you know, ride until you, you know, you use up a whole tank of gas. I got a little more than a half on here. sound like it's uh, running quite as smooth as it should be I could be wrong but It's idling right. Of course, I brought it to uh, Harley, and uh, you know they put it. They told me first, well, well, that's that's normal. That's normal. And uh, so they went ahead and put it on the machine and charged me sixty-seven dollars. And I should have told them, well, if it's normal. Then why did you put it on the machine and charge me $67? You know, Harley Davidson, Harley Davidson is, is a ripoff. You know, not, not their bikes, their bikes are nice. But their business they do, uh, their, their sales and their, uh, you know the stuff in their stores way all way overpriced and you know but people buy it so I, I don't know I mean I'm one of them but I'm getting to where uh, I'm gonna stop buying their stuff I mean uh, you know I've been kind of screwed over since I sat foot in that place I'm not gonna get into the details but uh that's all they do is try to squeeze money out of you. It's overpriced. Everything they got in them little stores is overpriced. Way overpriced. And, you know, and it's all because of the fucking name. I'll tell you what, they're uh they're in a slump right now. Because uh you know the younger guys and girls coming up they're not buying Harleys they're buying the cross rockets or something 
cheaper, you know. Uh, the uh, Yamahas or the uh, the V. Uh, shit, what's them other bikes? They're buying less expensive. I'm not necessarily cheaper, but they're buying less expensive bikes. You know, for Harley to charge as much as they do for their bikes and their products, you know, they ought to at least give good service, you know. They ought to take care of their, their customers, and they don't. They squeeze every penny they can out of you. You know, charge me 67 fucking dollars for nothing. You know, I bought this, it's almost been a year I've had this bike and the idle has always been the same, you know, 1,010, 1,015, 1,020, it fluctuate in there. And all of a sudden, it drops down to, to uh, 980, you know, 990, and it'll, it'll come back up, but it still drops down there. All of a sudden, after almost a year, and they're telling me there ain't nothing wrong with it. That's that's what Harley, that's what they do. So why'd you charge me the 67 fucking dollars? You know, I just don't care for their, their uh, sales tactics. And like I said, if, they, if they're gonna charge the amount they do for these bikes and their, and their uh, clothes wear and, and accessories way overpriced then, then they should at least uh, you know give people slack on the service and they don't sure the fuck don't sun now. I come home to get a sweatshirt and there's the damn sun. Anyway. Oh you can't I can't find neutral on here for nothing man. There it is. Son of a bitch. All right. See ya.